What's up guys, this is Gary Mathias, aka Martial Artist 92. It is very late, I'm gonna keep my voice down. But we got Mass Effect 2, the next part of the Mass Effect Legendary Edition. Let's do this. See if we can. Yep. Import ME1. Fuck yeah, man. easy, you know, you can dig around, so fuck off. Have one, yep. And I'd say that's good. Yep, we're good. Shepard did everything right. More than we could have hoped for. Commander Shepard uncovered the truth. And still it's not enough. We're at war. No one wants to admit it, but humanity is under attack. But they're sending her to fight Geth. Geth? We both know they're not the real threat. The Reapers are still out there. And it's up to us to stop them. The Council will never trust Cerberus. They'll never accept our help. Even after everything humanity has accomplished. But Shepard... They'll follow her. She's a hero. A bloody icon. But she's just one woman. If we lose Shepard, humanity might well follow. <coughs> then see to it that we don't lose her. The elusive man. Or as I call him, the creepy guy with the crazy eyes. Ships buzzing like a bee. Mission sinks active. Board is green. We are running silent. We're wasting our time. Four days searching up and down this sector, and we haven't found any sign of Geth activity. Three ships went missing here in the past month. Something happened to them. My money's on slavers. The terminus system is crawling with them. Picking up something on the long range scanner. Unidentified vessel. Hmm, looks like a cruiser. Doesn't match any known signatures. Cruiser is changing course. Now on intercept trajectory. Oh, uh, shit. Stealth systems are engaged. There's no way a Geth ship could pop. It's not the Geth. Brace for evasive maneuvers! <laughs> <laughs> Ensign's gone. Jesus fucking Christ. Weapons offline. Somebody get that fire out. Evacuate. I'm not leaving either. 
Time to argue. I need you to get the crew onto the evac shuttles. I'll take care of Joker. Shepard, we are at go. Now. Aye, aye. Could have gone better. Come on, Joker. We have to get out of here. No, I won't abandon the Normandy. I can still save her. The Normandy's lost. Going down with the ship won't change that. Yeah, okay. Help me up. <sighs> They're trying to <coughs> That's not good. Yep. Lack of oxygen. Brain starts to fail. Body goes into shock. Shut down of vital organs. And yep, now passing through the Earth's atmosphere. Or she'll burn up. Cheerful. Jeez, man. I hope one day I have the balls to go out like that. <laughs> Mass Effect 2. No. Commander Shepard has been recovered. The Lazarus Project will proceed as planned.
Wonders of futuristic technology. Like, holy shit. Missing in action. Yep. <sighs> Accepted port face. soldier this time. Reacting to outside stimuli, showing an awareness of her surroundings. Oh my God, Miranda! I think she's waking up. Damn it, Watson! She's not ready yet. Give her the sedative. Shepard, don't try to move. Just lie still. Try to stay calm. Heart rate's still climbing. Brain is <coughs> off the charts. Stats pushing into the red zone. It's not working. Another dose now. Heart rate dropping. Stats falling back into normal range. <laughs> Too close. We almost lost her. I told you your estimates were off. Run the numbers again. Well, that went well. Wake up, Commander. <coughs> doesn't have a thermal clip. It's a med bay. We'll get you a clip from... Damn it! Those canisters by the door are going to blow. Get behind cover now. Yes. All right. Shit. There you go. Keep moving. We need to get to the shuttle. 
Suck awesome. it, bitch. Save this. More reinforcements heading your way. Oh, here, here we come go. The mechs. Use the grenade. Alert. Ah! Ah! Suck it, bitch. Take the elevator down one floor. There we go. That was, that was the first time. Shitload of credits and a shitload of materials. All right, good shit. All right, it's opened up. Log update: The cost of this project is astronomical, over four billion credits so far. But nobody seems to care that we've gone over budget. I don't know where the boss gets all his money. Maybe it's better not to know. I just wish he'd kick a little more in my direction once in a while. <laughs> That's it for this. Moving on. Probably know more than I do. Right, sorry about that. 
I'm Jacob Taylor. I've been stationed here for- Hostiles detected. Damn it! Nice shot. Things must be worse than I thought if Miranda's got you running around. I'll fill you in, but we better get you to the shuttle first. Sounds like a plan. It's your station, Jacob. I'll follow you. First step, let's finish off these metal bastards. We're low on thermal clips, but I'm a biotic. Just give the order when you want me to hit him with the good stuff. Alright. Show me what you got. Falling back. Ready to get the ball off this station? Before we go anywhere, I need some answers. Sure. What do you want to know? You said they spent two years rebuilding me. How bad were my injuries? I'm no doctor, but it was bad. When I first saw you, you were nothing but meat and tubes. Anywhere Jesus else, they'd have put Christ. you in a coffin. But Project Lazarus was different. Cutting edge technology. What do you mean, huh. cloning? Cybernetics? I don't know the details. You'd have to ask the scientists. But I'm pretty sure you're not a clone. They wanted to bring you back exactly as you were. You're still you. Shit. You just might have a few extra bits and pieces now. What can you tell me about the project? Were there other test subjects? Project Lazarus only had one subject. The whole point was to bring you back. Just you. Even that was a challenge. Two years. All the top scientists. The best technology money could buy. Do you know anything about this attack? Who's behind it? What they're after? Dan Fino. I was getting ready for some shut-eye, then BAM! Bunch of explosions. Next thing I know, every damn mech in the place starts shooting. At us. I'm guessing it had to be an inside job. You'd need top security access to hack all the mechs. Jesus. The last thing I remember is the Normandy blowing up. Did anyone else make it? Just about everybody survived. A few servicemen from the lower decks didn't get out. Navigator Presley was killed by an explosion. But everyone else, including the non-alliance crew, the Asari, Liara, and the Quarian, they all made it out alive. Do you know what any of them are doing now? I don't know, Commander. It's been two years. They've moved on. Left the Alliance. Could be anywhere. Damn. They were my team. If they knew I was alive, they'd come back. Maybe you can track them down after we get off the station. If we get off the station. What's your job here? Depends on who you ask. Technically, I'm Miranda's top lieutenant. But I'm just a soldier. I served five years in the Alliance before this. Now I'm in charge of the station's security. Usually a lot more dull than this. Normally I don't fire my gun unless it's target practice. <laughs> when I first woke up, someone named Miranda was talking to me over the radio. We lost contact just before I ran into you. Miranda Lawson is the station's ranking officer. She led the Lazarus team. It was her job to bring you back to life, no matter what. Should have guessed she'd try to save you. She's not about to give up on you now. You said you lost contact. Could you tell what was happening? There was some gunfire and an explosion right before I lost her. She knows how to take care of herself. But I hope she's okay. All right, we gotta go. What's the quickest way to those no. shuttles? The <clears throat> where the mechs are thickest. Probably best if we check. Check. Anyone on this frequency? Anybody still alive out there? Hello? Wilson, this is Jacob. I'm here with Commander Shepard. Just took out a wave of mechs over in D Wing. Shepard's alive? How the hell? Never mind. You need to get her out of there. Get to the service tunnels and head for the network control room. Roger that, Wilson. Stay on this frequency. I think I remember a Wilson checking on me one time when I woke up. That's him. He's the chief medical tech. Answers directly to Miranda. Come on. The service tunnels are this way. Alright. Let's grab this ammo. Cool. Moving on. Go. Threat 
detected. Damn it, Lord. This room is full of effects. The whole station is crawling with mechs. I'm doing the best I can. I'm not I'm not die. You're done! Gotta hurt! Ah. the first time I regained consciousness. Yeah, that was me. <clears throat> How about we talk about this after we fix my leg? Should be some Metagel in the first aid station on the wall. Hopefully there's enough to get him up and moving again. Grab the Metagel from the first aid station on the wall. Shut down the security mechs, but whoever did this fried the whole system. Completely irreversible. We didn't ask what you were doing. Why do you even have security mech clearance? You were in the bio wing. Weren't you listening? I came here to try and fix this. Besides, I was shot. How do you explain that? You're all strangers I don't to trust me. Any Let's of get you. someplace uh, safe and then we'll sort out whose fault it is. Right, Shepard. We need to find Miranda. We can't leave her behind. Uh, forget about Miranda. She was over in D-Wing. The mechs were all over that sector. There's no way she survived. A bunch of mechs won't drop Miranda. She's alive. Then where is she? Why haven't we heard from her? There are only two possible explanations. She's either dead, or she's a traitor. Then why did she wake me up and warn me about the attack? Okay, maybe she's not a traitor. But that doesn't change the facts. We're here, she's not. We need to save ourselves. The shuttle bay is only a few. We can overload the canisters to clear a path to the shuttles. There you go. That's it. Let's get out of here. Right. Okay, we took him down. But this is getting tense. Shepard, if I tell you who we work for, will you trust me? This really isn't the time, Jacob. We won't make it if she's expecting a shot in the back. If you want to piss off the boss, it's your ass, Jacob. The Lazarus Project. The program that rebuilt you. It's funded and controlled by Cerberus. Ah, uh, Cerberus. I think I ran into <coughs> Cerberus a few times while I was investigating Saren. Some kind of pro-human splinter group, right? Well, that's what the Alliance wants people to believe. But there's more to it. The Alliance declared you dead. They gave up. Cerberus spent a fortune to bring you back. Look, I'd be suspicious too, but right now we have to work together. I thought you deserved to know what's what. Once we're off the station, I'll take you to the elusive man. He'll explain everything. I promise. I don't care what they did or what you say. I am not working with terrorists. You can tell it to the boss, but after we've saved our butts, we're almost at the shuttle. Yeah, considering what the service was into in the last game, yeah, I don't like that.
Cover. Load. Through here, we're almost at the Miranda. Surprise, you bitch. Well, damn. Dead. What the hell are you doing? My job. Wilson betrayed us all. Even if you're sure, did he deserve that welcome? He sabotaged the security systems, killed my staff, and he would have killed us. You sure about that, Miranda? We've known Wilson for years. What if you're wrong? I'm never wrong. I thought you'd have learnt that by now, Jacob. You should have taken him alive. See what he knew. Too risky. I've put too much time and effort bringing you back to life to let you get killed now. You really think Wilson's capable of that? Not anymore. If you say so. What's That's our next step? Nice. We get on the shuttle and go. My boss wants to speak to you. You mean the elusive man? I know you work for Cerberus. Ah, Jacob. I should have known your conscience would get the better of you. Lying to the commander isn't the way to get her to join our cause. Well, since we're getting everything out in the open, is there anything else you want to ask before we go, Commander? Convenient that you show up as we're leaving. Where were you during the attack? Besides trying to save your life? Wilson figured out I was helping you when he sent an army of mechs to take me out. I got here as soon as I could. Probably a little too soon, if you ask, Wilson. What about the rest of the people on the station? This is the evac area. If they're not here now, they're not coming. We can't leave without knowing for sure. We need to go back and look. Don't you get it? The only one worth saving is you. Everyone else is expendable. She's right. We all knew the risks when we signed up. Without you, there's no point to any of this. That's kind of cold. Where are we going? Another Cerberus facility. The elusive man is waiting for you there. I'm not sure I trust you. This is the only shuttle off the station. You want to stay and rot with the mechs? Be my guest. You're the Lazarus Project's director, aren't you? That's right. I put two years of my life into this project. Into you. What does Cerberus want from me? Maybe you should ask the elusive man when you meet him. He poured virtually unlimited resources into Lazarus. Obviously, he has some kind of plan for you. I'm so sure I feel great about that. I've had that. enough of this station to last a lifetime. Or two, in your case. Come on.
Before you meet with the elusive man, we need to ask a few questions to evaluate your condition. Come on, Miranda. More tests? Shepard took down those mechs without any trouble. That has to be good enough. It's been two years since the attack. The elusive man needs to know that Shepard's personality and memories are intact. Ask the questions. Did you say two years? I've been gone that long? Two years and twelve days. And you were on an operating table for most of it. The sooner we start, the sooner we can be done. Start with personal history. Okay. Records show you grew up on Earth. Tough environment, no parents. You enlisted and won a medal fighting Batarians during the Skillian Blitz. Do you remember that? A lot of lives depended on me holding that position. I did what I had to. Because I'm a However badass. you want to put it, it was damn impressive. <clears throat> I had friends who were there. Satisfied, Miranda? Almost. Let's try something more recent. Vermeyer, where you destroyed Saren's cloning facility. You had to leave one of your squad behind to die in the blast. Lieutenant Caden Elenko was killed in action. It was your call. Why did you leave him behind? I left a friend to die that day, and I didn't do it casually. But I had to save as many people as I could. Caden gave his life for the rest of the team. Without him, I couldn't have stopped Saren. He died a hero. I understand, Commander. And I wasn't judging your decision. Everybody at Cerberus knows that cloning facility had to be destroyed. There are other tests we really should run. Come on, Miranda. Enough with the quizzes. The memories are there, and I can vouch for Shepard's combat skills personally. I suppose you're right. We'll have to hope the elusive man accepts our little field test as evidence enough. <laughs> The elusive man is waiting for you in the other room. <clears throat> Alright, well that's gonna be it for this episode. Yep. Sure to like, subscribe, share it out, spread the word, and I'll see you all in the next video, whatever I make. Take care and peace.